Uh, my name is Ghadir, and um, I'm going to present my project uh, during the fellowship um, in the past uh, eight weeks, um, mainly on improving the tag on HGX. Um, I'm a uh, little more about me. I'm a Palestinian, and I'm currently a PhD student in uh, Qatar, um, and uh, enjoying the Netherlands. Um, so data science uh, generally is uh, the domain where uh, we want to use machine learning and, technic uh, and uh, technical or analytic uh, techniques to uh, better understand the data and build insight from the data. And one aspect of this is to uh, better uh, provide better techniques for accessing and understanding the data. For example, we have here um, HDX, which is the humanitarian data exchange platform, where, uh, where the, which is a kind of repository for uh, data sets on the humanitarian uh, domain, and uh, where people upload the data set here and would be available for a humanitarian actor. And usually, the user interact with this um, platform by search a query. So they add some a few, key, few key phrases or words on the search of this system. And then they get results based on this uh, um, search, um, search, uh, search query. I think I want to use this. No, that's OK. So, um, so for example, here, if the user enters education, Yemen, he will get all the data set that uh, has these keywords of ed education and Yemen. So um, these keywords could be tagged for the data set. What I mean here by the tag is like keywords that represent or express these dat data sets. And here I will build on this point that searching the, that, the humanitarian data center, uh, the data um, uh, platform, uh, means like I want the user to interact with uh, this platform and get better results and relevant results. So I will look at this uh, problem uh, deeply of how we can improve the tagging that we provide for the data set in the humanitarian data exchange uh, uh, platform so people uh, will, be, will be confident to find always the relevant uh, information on our data sets on this um, uh, platform. So why this important? Again, so if the user finds the relevant information, he will interact with the system, and then he will download the data, and then will use it later. But if he would, uh, couldn't find the relevant information from the early beginning, so he will not interact with the, with the uh, HDX. One more thing is that people usually, or data providers, will add these tags to their own data sets. So they usually, if every like user will has, uh, uh, will have different tags or different query phrases to represent the data set, or uh, even though they are talking in the same thing, like education and literacy, for example. So my approach to understand this problem is to go through exploring the HDX deeply by using the interface and compare the, the, the keywords or the tags that used uh, uh, to the uh, search results. And uh, more to uh, talk to the team, and then mainly because it's an exi existing uh, problem and challenge for the technical team who deal with, is like the mapping with the tags, with the keywords, with the search results, and also with the meaning of these uh, tags and uh, uh, keywords. Uh, I use the HDX API, which is uh, to, to crowd the data set. What I mean here by the API is like application uh, a programming interface where I can interact with HDX by developing a code that will interact automatically with the HDX without the user interface. Uh, the last thing is I, I tested different methods uh, in the text analysis uh, uh, techniques and uh, uh, a way to improve these uh, tags. And also, um, I focus my analysis on education data sets, around like 600 data sets in this, uh, uh, in, in available on HDX, and um, more than like 1,000 line of code to test different similarity methods. Um, so for example here, this is a, a, a current data set exists in, in, in HDX and has two keywords at the bottom, like these phrases. One is education, which does make sense on, on this context, but the other one doesn't make sense at, at all. It doesn't convey any uh, meaning for the user to, to find it in the data set. So uh, the model would be able to find something like this. For example, uh, six and age desegregated is, is something related or is important tag or phrase for this data set, even though the, 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 these keywords are, are, uh, doesn't appear or didn't appear at all on uh, the, the, the metadata or the description of this data set. Uh, the solution is to use the sum of text analysis techniques and machine learning to uh, analyze the, 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 the data sets at the beginning 
mainly the metadata about the data set at the beginning. What I mean at the beginning, at the stage of uploading the data set to HGX, and we able to understand the, uh, what the relevant uh, tags will be able to use for this uh, data set. So here I simulate like yeah, um, the, the, the module or tags uh, uh, su uh, suggesting um, like yeah, module in action. Uh, so here, one of the available data set, and here I uh, simulate the HGX upload page, and this is existing and HGX, but I, I build my own like uh, simulation uh, uh, upload page. So here, for example, we have the upload page where the data provider will come and, and upload the, the, the data set. Um, once you choose, for example, uh, this data set, it's, it's the same as uh, the data sets, like Nigeria ex example. We'll get some review about this data set, and then by the tag analysis, he will get some of the suggested tag to use for this data set. So once the data provider provides this data set to the system, he will get the most appropriate uh, uh, tags to use to, uh, to add to, to his data sets based on the analysis. And then later, these phrases, whenever user use them for the session dashjx, he will find this data set. More close uh, a look at these tags, for example, the, this will be depends on ranking these results to the user, and he can see their score for each tag. So you know how relevant would be each tag of them to the data set to use them to uh, to his data, data set. So uh, building in this, I applied my analysis on that education data sets. So would be my recommendation later to apply the same model and the same analysis to the whole uh, data sets available on HGX. Uh, for the sake of understanding more, maybe uh, analysis about the usage of the keywords, and then uh, try to maybe uh, adjust some similarity methods. Um, I used uh, using the, 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 this the tag module will help in uh, understanding another aspect about the data sets because they are right now we have different categories like health and, and education. But what if we ha need another another way of uh, um, uh, understanding the, that the data set available in HGX, maybe there is another category or, uh, or, or aspect of contextual content uh, uh, or contextual uh, relation between these data sets. And more thi one more thing is to integrate this module as a tag suggestion at the interface of uploading on HGX. And thank you.